Hello everyone, I am your Joyful Beast, and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. Now the last episode, I was having a little more luck finding all the necessary items to get moving, but not a lot of luck trying to find silver and some other items. So I decided to go back out and uh, get some more things. And I have some cool stuff here that we can finally make. So first things first, um, you can tell that I have some more recipes pinned on the side there. The first thing I'm going to make is let's make the mineral detector first. And what this will do, as far as I understand it, detector can sniff out raw materials potentially saving you hundreds of hours of searching. This is really helpful. So yeah, this will help us find minerals a lot faster than what we've been doing. It also fixes one of the problems with the first Subnautica in which you had to spend hours trying to find everything. Now, unfortunately that got rid of our copper wire, but I believe if I go back here, oh no, I actually used the copper up. Well, shoot. How much copper do we need for this? Is it two copper? Two copper. Ah, uh, okay. 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 Good to know. Good to know. So basically, this means we need a lot more items. That, that's basically what this just meant. Uh, but that's okay. Because that allows me to uh, really get moving here on some stuff. So first of all, let's assign our handy new mineral detector down here. And let's try it out a second. So as you can tell here, um, we can actually search through for all kinds of different materials that we found. So in our case, we're looking for copper ores. And all we have to do down here is start searching around for it I and mean, it doesn't sound that much fun but this works for uh, any materials that you might have lost in the wild but actually i think what we need let me get over here a minute ah ah limestone oh ooh, oh that's so nice all oh, that's so nice actually, i actually don't know if it's titanium that you need but oxygen hang on let me get up here a second Every, so every time that this vibrate, that, well, not that this vibrates, but every time that it beeps, I can feel it in here. And the closer I get, the stronger it gets. That is so good. There's copper. There's our copper. Where do we have our, well, our base is over there, which means I think if we go on the other side of there, uh, we can get to some of our creep vines. Cause we're gonna need those in a second. We're going to need that for some silicone rubber, I believe. Which we can get right here. See, I've been trying to get ahead on everything that we need for all these. There we go. I guess we used it all up. So yeah, that mineral detector is going to be extremely useful, uh, especially for finding the calvarite outcrops. Um, that's something I haven't shown you guys yet, but that's actually where you get gold. And that's something that I personally have been having a lot of difficulty fight, uh, finding. You guys have no idea. All right, so we're going to make... Wait, am I wrong? <sighs> Shoot. Well, while we're here, why don't we just go ahead and make our copper for a minute? because I want to get our compass going here right away. Um, yeah, do that. And then we can take that out of here since we have that and it's done. And now we have a compass. All of a sudden we are getting so far into this that it's not even going to be funny how fast things are going to go now. 
All right, inventory's full. That is fine. That is fine. Now, we really do need to build a base, like, badly. So the sooner we can find gold, the better. Because, my gosh, I, I need a base with a battery charger. Because I'm running out of power on all my batteries so fast. Okay, good, 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 good. We also, I, and I, I'll show this to you guys real quick. We also did get the, um, the sea truck unlocked. But in order to do that, I need to basically get all of the items that I'm still trying to find for the habitat builder. And I believe the mobile, yeah, so the mobile vehicle bay. Um, there's a lot of stuff I've been trying to really get through the last uh, several, well, several minutes. It has been an hour since the I've been... The facilitates extensive free diving by recycling air more efficiently at significant depths. Breathe the freedom. Breathe the freedom. Oh, I will. And what is this? Oh, 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 we need that. We need that. We're going to need that for our sea truck as well as for when we build, start building bases. That came in handy. So basically what I'm going to do here is now that we have the rebreather and that should be, yep, that's already on. We can take off the wiring kit for now because we're going to need the computer kit next. We're gonna need a lot of stuff next, dang it. Okay, okay, that's fine. That is fine. We can we can always get more copper. This this is fine. This is all fine. Um, but what I'm what I am gonna show you guys quick um, is where I found some of the uh, calvarite op outcrops, basically. And I hate it. <laughs> I'm just telling you, I hate this location so much already. It, it is just so dark. So we need to go back over here to where our Delta station dock is. And I think I already commented how much I hate this area. But to no surprise, as I said the last time, it's where you find the good resources. And right here is our Calvary, uh, is our Calvary outcrop. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. That is fine. We're gonna get everything right now. How much did we get? So we got two gold, good. All right, we don't, okay. We don't have to go back there. We have to, well, we have to go back there at some point, but not for right now. Oh, shoot. I'm not gonna die here again. The other thing too about over here, um, and I'll show you the beacon here once I get back under the water. Um, Alan found for us another well, not another, but our first site that we can go to um, to find some artifacts. Which is insane. Which, which yeah, I mean, it is insane, but it's insanely useful. That's what I meant to say. This game is having so many audio glitches. I don't know if that's because of me recording or if it's that it's actually having issues. Hard to say. Very hard to say. Oh, and oh my goodness, that almost... I, I hope that didn't make you guys queasy, because that just made me a little queasy. Ay, 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 ay. All right. Let us see here. I need some ribbon plant. Here's a ribbon plant. I think I saw, yep, another one over here, so that's going to be nice for our battery. I also don't know if I got enough copper yet. If we didn't, that's okay. Um, it just means that we're going to have to do a little more digging, but rest assured, we're about to get everything going in no time. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is what I feared. We're going to need copper ore. I thought I picked copper up or no, it's the gold I'm thinking of. Oh. I thought I picked copper up. That is weird. That's just really weird. Well, anyway, well, once we get copper, two, two copper, we can make the uh, copper wire too. 
that's okay. We're slowly nearing some parts where we can just get moving. Um, and I'm loving it. I'm just loving the fact that we are moving along in this game so fast that we don't need lead. And it's titanium. How did I guess that? How did I guess it was titanium? Let me guess, are you titanium? Yep. Yeah, limestone usually gives you titanium. That's what I'm starting to learn from all this. It's, uh... Oh, wait, there's some copper. What is... Oh, my word, it followed us out here. Or are we near the... Where are we? I didn't know it could come out that far. Oxygen. Yikes. Okay, well, anyway. Uh, so, yeah, we can now make a battery, but we're gonna need... Two more copper. So I'm wrong. Limestone sometimes gives you a chance of copper. There we go. And I think we need one more. I thought, yep, yeah, there you are. Titanium again. I'm leaving the titanium go because... Are you going to die? Are you going to die? Good. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen. Oh, my word. And I'm really looking forward to when we finally get a better uh, oxygen mask. Or not oxygen mask, oxygen tank. Oxygen mask. What am I thinking? Oh, there we go. Copper. Okay, we're good. 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 And also the sea monkey, some can, I don't know if I mentioned it the last time. But the sea monkeys can, at this point, um, instead of stealing things from us, they've kind of changed their tune, and they will start gifting us items. Um, and it's all at random. So sometimes it's the items that we need, and other most of the time it's items that we don't need, items we don't want. Nevertheless, that is extremely helpful. All right, so we need to make a battery. And we need copper wire. And I believe we also can make a computer chip now, which is great. I've been sitting on that for ages. And now that just leaves us with the wiring kit, which requires us to go track down silver. That is easy at this point for me. I'm going to go right back over to here. Seek fluid intake. All right, we'll seek fluid intake. I think I made some water earlier. Yes, I did. Vital signs stabilizing. Lovely. Yeah, there's so many things you have to keep track in this game. And, and that's what I love about it. It's, it's what I love about it, but also what I hate. I kind of hate the fact that you have a lot of stuff that you need to keep track of, but also love that it keeps you on edge. Okay, so we're not looking for Galanta. No. No, no, no. We need to go way deeper for the good stuff. Warning. 30 seconds of oh, my word. Oh, my word. Okay. So now we're running into the problem of the last time. And I can already see that we're losing power here. That's okay. Um, I don't think I need my scanner at the moment. Let me go ahead and unload that. And then exchange that with this, because I need to put the battery in for the other stuff here. Because all we're looking for right now is going right to the bottom here, where we're having trouble breathing. And get those argentite, or argent, arginite, uh, uh, m uh, minerals, m uh, outcrops, minerals, outcrops. I can't think for the life of me because I'm trying to think through what I need to do here. Ooh, get me some more gold. All right. Oh, 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 okay. I felt some stuff here. Hang on. Okay. Oh, oh, that's so handy because of the compass. Where is it? It's on the other side of this? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay. 
Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. Good thing an oxygen plant was there. All right. I'm going to let them follow me out here a little bit. They can follow me out while I'm trying to get to the surface here to breathe. This doesn't save us hours of time here. But it does save us quite a bit of time. Which is really good. Really, really good. And it, believe me, it's going to get even better when we get the uh, sea truck going. Because my gosh. Okay, I don't think I want to be down here. What is that? No, 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 no. That is the squid shark. No. That? Okay. Whatever I saw the last episode was not what I was thinking. That is the squid shark. We don't want to deal with that right now. We're going to have to go down there eventually. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. I can't outrun this. I cannot outrun this. Warning. 30 oh, dear. Seconds of oh, dear. Oxygen. Oh, dear. <laughs> Where? It's right over here. All right. You know what? Is this it right here? No. Okay. Forget it. 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 I want to run back up here before I start dying. <laughs> Oxygen. Oh, my word. This is going to be really close. This is going to be extremely close. Oh, this is going to be real close. Oh, okay. It's really tough to go down there with those fish. I, I, I'm serious. Once we get the sea truck and some really good upgrades. This is going to go so much faster. You all have no, no idea. You don't even know. Because I think we don't start hitting the, at least here we don't start hitting some of this good material until like 200 meters. Oh, okay, 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 it's on here. Right here, there we go. Silver. I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. No, I don't. Right here. Good. 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 We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We can get out of here. We can leave. Okay, good. We're going to get our habitat builder done. And only took us 20 minutes. Yeah, sorry if that got a little boring. Just a tiny bit. Um, but believe me, once we get all of this stuff, we can start properly exploring this great wide open world well actually we can't explore too much of it we're gonna have to get more upgrades followed by more upgrades followed by further venture into places that we don't want to go that the game is gonna make us go and now one of the most important parts of our journey begins all right we're gonna need the wiring kit and we're going to need to put in not put in but hang on we're going to need not that habitat builder adding emergency shelter blueprints to your data bank sweet with the builder tool you can construct sea bases from raw materials yep advising against exploring a frozen water continent without a base no bed no storage no place to put a fabricator module. No fun. <laughs> that is right. It is no fun at all. And oh shoot. You know what battery it put in to this one? Let me show you quick. I think it put in the... Vital signs stabilizing. Yeah, it didn't put in our good battery. It put in the dead one. Shoot. Right, well, we're going to put it in there. And we're going to exchange it with this. Sweet. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys very quickly um, how we build bases in this game. Because I don't believe you can... I don't believe we can extend this one. 
So we're gonna have to build a whole new base. And where I'm gonna set up base is gonna be right around maybe here. Maybe right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right here, right here, right here's good. Right here's good. So we can set up our foundation for our base. I'm gonna set up right in here. Oh, shoot. Yeah, this is how you construct it. Sweet. Now, now that where it says about that strength hole or whatever is very important. It's extremely important for us. So, I'm gonna go back in and we need six titanium. Well, guess where we ha just happen to have a lot of titanium. That's right. Right in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. In fact, you know what? Let's just take it all. Just take it all. You know? Why not? And we can just build our multi purpose room. Which. Wait, why do you have. Okay, this is weird. This is weird. Well, what? Well, why did we need the foundation in the first place? Well, this gives me another idea, too. Um, if you ever have too much stuff, you can just deconstruct it. That is fine. Um, is what we're going to do. Let me just see here a minute. Or maybe we did need to build that. Shoot. Okay. I, okay. Okay. I keep thinking that I need to press down the trigger to construct it. And instead it's holding down X or cross. I guess as Sony wants me to say, it will always be known as X to me. There's no way in which it's not known as X. Can you actually build it? Wow. You can. That is weird. That's so weird. All right, so if we're going to do that, then we need to build a hatch. Yes. Give us a hatch. Oh, I, I swear, this is going to take me some time to get used to. I'm sorry. And now you can see how every time we add on something, it makes it, it lessens the strength of the base. So we need to be very, very mindful of this. Um, the other thing we're going to need to build that's going to be super important, and I don't know if we have it yet. Yeah, because you need copper. Um, you need copper and you need quartz. So we're going to quickly get that. Get up here. Relax for a little bit. Go back in. Oh, boy. Um, yeah, we're going to need copper and quartz. And what that's going to allow us to do is it's going to allow us to basically... Uh, give our give our site some uh, power, which is very important because it also gives us oxygen. So you know, if you don't want to uh, die in your base, you better build a solar panel in order to make it good. All right, we got some more resources here. Um, overall, this is kind of off topic. There's the copper, or is it gold that we need? What do we need quick? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, we need one more quartz. Oh, that's easy. That's easy. Now, playing this game on the PS5 um, is actually really good so far. It's really, really good. Um, there are some glitches that I'm noticing, some little hiccups here and there. But for the most part, this is as much of a next-gen console experience for this game as I would have hoped. It really is that good. And if you have a PS5 and have been wondering how good this game is, I, I highly recommend it so far. I mean, it's Subnautica. How can you go wrong with this? How, how can you go wrong with one of the best open world ge survival games ever made, essentially? Okay. So now, as you can see, we have done it. All primary systems online. Welcome aboard, Captain. Now, here's where the fun begins. We are going to make a few different things. So, yeah, the bioreactor. It took me so long to actually get into this. 
in the first game to get the bioreactor. For us to get that immediately is amazing. And for us to even get all this stuff already is amazing. So this is all the stuff that we can build. Some of this stuff we've scanned already. Um, others, it comes with the habitat builder. Um, so we can build Fred's bed. It's not just that we can build a single bed. We can build Fred's bed. Ain't that interesting. First things first. We're going to make a locker. I'm going to put the locker here. And that's going to hold... Actually, we can make a few lockers. That's fine. Um, and we'll hold some different materials in these. Um, I'm not going to name them quite yet since I don't know what's going to go in each, in each one. But we'll just do that. So that's number one. Okay, so we're going to make a battery charger because that's something we definitely are going to need. Um, a modification station we're certainly going to need. And we're going to also make... We should make a bed. We should absolutely make a bed. So those are the th three things I'm going to focus on. And we're going to see how far we can get with all of them. Um, oh, shoot. You really want me to make another computer chip? All right. That's fine. The more that we're doing this, the easier it gets. We're going to focus on copper wire first. I don't know why I had the habitat builders still sitting there, but you know what? I'm reaching the point where I just stop caring. So titanium, copper, good. I think we need one more copper, which thankfully we have some right, some stuff right here. I think the chance is 50-50 on whether or not you get a, uh, a titanium or copper. What's this over here? Is that another? Yes. Copper, good. All right, so we got copper. Got our copper wire. That's really good. We're also gonna need a wiring kit, which we need silver for. I should have just put my base further out here. That's really what I should have done. Wait, we need quartz for this? Wait a minute. All right, all right, we'll need quartz in a second for that. Actually, I think that might be a different type of quartz from what I'm looking at. We might not be able to build the modification station yet. And that's okay if we can't. Let's see. Let us see. Let us see. Let us see. Let us see. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I see that. So do we have an oxygen plant somewhere? Yes, we do. It's like they open up, and I love that they just open up to you when you get down low enough. It's just so inviting. It's like, come to me. Get your strength back. We can tell you need it. I don't want to use too many up, but I'm going to just do that. Jeez, that could have been bad. And that down there is where that down there lurks uh, for better or worse hell. Pick up creature egg. Okay, I think we can use that to hatch some creatures. That's pretty cool. Hello, buddies. I am back. I am back. Come towards me. Come towards me. You know you want to. There's our silver. So that leads us with one more to find. One more. One more. And where are we at here? Oh, crap. All right. What don't we need? This is why I needed the battery charger ASAP. This is why. Just gets too much. It's too much. All right, we're doing well time-wise, though. That's that's really good. I'm just going to get up here quick. Oh, my word. We don't have any. All right. Um, or we're going to take that out. And I'm going to... Replace it with this. And we're just going to mind our uh, battery life as we do this. Where? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, right here? No. 
Oh, right here. Shoot. Wait, what is this? Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. What in the... That was cool. That was really cool. I feel like I'm moving way in a direction that I shouldn't be yet. Or not that I shouldn't be, but oh, wait, wait, where is everything? Yeah, I'm really moving out far. Gotta be careful of that. Or next thing I know, I'm gonna be in a spot I don't wanna be. But then again, isn't that kind of the point? All right, it is now officially getting darker. I don't like that. Less dark, Seek more light. Intake. Frick. What is this? Wait a minute. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Hang on. Limestone, limestone, limestone. Oh, gosh. Hello? I'll just continue to move down here. I think this was the spot that I was before that I didn't want to be. Oh, yeah. This is the spot. What? Oh, my goodness. Run, run. Okay. I'm not dealing with this... I'm not dealing with it. I ain't dealing with it. Nope. 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 Because the last thing I need to do is die down there. Maybe we'll take the sea truck down there. Once we unlock that. But we ain't doing that right now. Give me oxygen. Thank you. Okay. Where else is our Arginite here? I'm probably missing all of it. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh. Okay. 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 Right here. Good, good, okay, good, 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 good. This could have gone better. This could not have gone better according to plan. And we're just gonna slowly make our way out here. So that way we can go build a wiring kit and that. And fiber mesh. Fiber mesh. I don't know how you... I, I have to look up fiber mesh when we get back to the base here. Sorry if this is getting a little boring. But, you know, we, we just... We gotta build our stuff. We just gotta build our stuff. While I'm here, how do you make fiber mesh? Oh, creep vines. Wait, don't I have that behind me? Heck yeah, I do. Let's make some fiber mesh and we got ourselves a bed. That's really good. Really, really good. And I'm going to make sure that I look at the material for... Not for Fred's bed, but for this. Seek fluid intake immediately. Oh, so you need a diamond for that. Okay, I hear you. I hear you. I heard you. So, uh, sorry about that. <laughs> I'm trying to make sure I have everything here that I need. Alright, so we're going to need to get more copper and another quartz for a fabricator to make over in the other base. I don't need that as much for right now, but it's going to come handy in any case. So now, welcome aboard, Captain. Yes, hello. Now watch this. We're going to use this very quickly. Oh wait. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We just got that in time. We just got that in time. So yeah, this is going to charge our batteries. Insanely useful. I've been, I've been looking forward to this for a long while now. What else, what else do we have in our arsenal that is not charged? It's looking like nothing. Really? Oh wait, yeah, here we go. Yeah, of course, the habitat builder. So... I'm going to take away power from our source there and exchange it here. And then we're going to put the dead battery in there and we're good. And now that we have this back, we can go ahead and make Fred's bed. I don't think it's Robin style, but you know what? That's all good. I'm actually going to build it right here. 
Yep, right there. I was going to say, that might be my style, but that's not necessarily anybody else's style. Now, I'm going to show you something real quick here that we can do. As soon as it gets dark like this, um, if you're having issues um, at night with seeing down below, um, you can actually get well rested. And this is going to be the problem. I'm going to want to come back to this base instead of the other one. That's, that's going to be the hard part of this. Vital signs stabilizing. Good. Now, I think once we go to sleep here, although we don't really need to go to sleep. <laughs> well, eventually, if it gets too much, we can go back here to sleep and it'll basically bring us right up to where it's sunlight outside so that we don't have to deal with the night anymore. Super useful. Super, super, super useful. And also, the other reason it's useful is because you can actually, if I go in here, you can actually sleep while these are charging. So what I'm gonna get going with, with here before we do anything else is I'm gonna make some batteries because we're gonna need them. I, I just feel it. It's gonna become a necessity anyway. We might have to make multiple battery chargers, believe it or not. And just wait until we get the sea truck. That's that's all I'm waiting for right now is to wait until we get this lovely sea truck. We'll probably have to save that for next week. That'll probably be our, be our big, big project moving forward. Let me just double check our batteries here. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, our batteries are getting good. Very, very good. So yeah, now we can go ahead and make some more batteries here. Fantastic. Can actually make two of them. Great. So now while the other stuff is charging, we'll go ahead and power these things back up. Very good. Now. Let me show you guys real quick, uh, moving forward, because we are nearing another hour, what we are going to need next. So we're going to need to make two things next in order to really get good. So first of all, we're going to have to go down to the architect spot at some point. Um, we're also going to need to go further out into some biomes in order to gain more resources and hopefully come across some really scary enemies. I'm looking forward to it. Kind of. So we're going to need a mobile vehicle bay. And what the mobile vehicle bay is going to let us create is the sea truck. Now, I thought I had a power cell though in my inventory. Maybe I put that in the other places over here. Or no, I did, I did, that's right. So, so you guys don't know this, but I made some materials earlier before I started recording this and put them into our storage here. So we have a power cell. I'm actually gonna take them a while. Power cell, titanium ingot, and glass. So I already made these. Um, I need more glass. I think we can actually make more glass. Yes. Good, 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 good. So we're going to need another wiring kit and some lead. We're also going to need some lubricant and a computer chip. Now, this is all very, very easy to make. Let me, let me tell you how easy this is to make. Maybe we can knock it out right now since we've already done some of this. Um, you need a seed cluster. And guess what? Already got a seed cluster right there. Easy. So we're already making our way through this. I, the, the better I get at recognizing all this stuff, the, the better this, the, the easier this game gets. I'm going to attempt to very quickly get all these materials to get us set up for the next episode. Um, which already we got copper. This is already going really, really well. 
I mean, I, I don't know how much how much better this could get. I, I kind of made my own beacon there called Twisty Bridges. So that way I know where certain biomes are. Um, you can use the beacons that we used in the last episode to do that. And yes, I know we are low on food. We are going to need food. Starvation imminent. Oh, wait. Seek calorie intake immediately. Okay, 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 okay. Don't, don't yell at me. Don't yell at me. This is not what I wanted. Oh, shoot. I'm going to need to get food. Oh, I didn't prepare for this. Oh, crap. I did not prepare, oh, did not prepare for this at all. Me. Come on. Give me a bladder fish. It's not the best thing to have, but it's better than nothing. Shoot, I should have done that first. But yeah, what we're gonna Oxygen. Uh, but what we're gonna do is get everything going here. Um, what? Well, just when I needed food, there's our food. Yummy, yummy. My gosh. I mean, <laughs> you can't get any more luckier than that. Now we can just keep going, keep going, keep going. I love it. We can just keep on moving. It's so good. Do you have anything for me, buddy? No. Well, I'm going to make myself known because I really want to show uh, the audience how you pick up stuff for me. Galen Galena. Oh, well, that's our lead that we need. Okay, so that helps. I forgot that we needed lead. Yep, welcome back to the Twisty Bridges. And we're just gonna do that. Do that. Got our table coral. We can make our copper in a little bit. Oh crap. I knew that, I knew it. I knew that was gonna happen. The next time I swear I'm going to get I'm going to get my knife out and add it. Not that it's going to do anything. If I can scare it off a little bit, that'll be good. All right, now where is silver? That's the real big question right now. I think it's all I mean, I, I'm actually surprised that I am. No. No. Oh, that was a close one. Let me go back down here to the oxygen thing. Quickly drop that. I know, I'm leaving materials all over the seafloor here. I, I gotta do that. <laughs> um, come on, we need we need one more of these Arginite outcrops. Oh, we're back here. Oh no. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh no, I'm- oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, run! Limestone. Where is this thing? Where is it? Although this looks- aha, aha, aha. Oh my goodness. I swear. Okay, One, okay, okay. We're done. Of oxygen remaining. We're done. That's fine. I'm moving back up. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to make our mobile vehicle bay. And what this will allow us to do is make all kinds of vehicles. Yeah, inventory full. I knew that. That's why I, I made it the way I did. Although, oh, interesting. Well, thank goodness we got storage right here. I'm gonna put all the titanium in there and then we're gonna get you. How much do you, oh wow, you take up a lot of space. That's a lot of space. That it is. Okay. So yeah, I, we're, we're basically just gonna get everything set up. I know it's telling me to, to release the vehicle bay, um, but we're gonna wait until the next episode to do that. So yeah, like I said, 
Tomorrow's going to be another Assassin's Creed episode, and then next week you're going to get three Subnautica episodes, two Assassin's Creed episodes, and then we'll see where things go from there because I don't know where things are going. It, it's all moving in a very interesting direction, okay? So yeah, thanks again for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, uh, please give it a like and leave me a comment below as to how you're enjoying this game so far. Um, you know, what, what you think the whole issue is with the pilot that uh, we discovered in the last episode, what Alan has to do with all of this. I, I'm just very, very excited to get into further depth with both games that we're playing through right now. And lastly, as always, please subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to see more episodes like this so that you are notified and are the first to know when another episode drops. So thanks again for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.